So last fall, I got a phone call from the team of Valentino, um, the designer Valentino, asking me if I wanted that they were working on La Traviata in Rome and would I like to come direct it? They need a director. Um, so I never planned on um, directing an opera, but when Valentino asked me if I would do La Traviata, I couldn't say no. But it's exciting to do something that um, you've never done before, and um, I'm learning a lot being here. Of course, the music is so beautiful in La Traviata, and there's parts of the story after working on Marie Antoinette that I can relate to um, a party girl in Paris uh, in that time period. We're setting it in the period that it takes place. The last few weeks working on the rehearsals, I've um, found that there are similarities. It's not that different from a movie when you're actually watching the scene and, and giving um, direction or getting ideas. But um, I don't know, I guess the big difference for me is having to look at everything at one time, the whole scene, where in a movie you separate each moment. And um, so I'm getting used to having to watch the whole scene with so many things happening at the same time. Valentino designed the costumes and I really wanted the sets and lighting to focus his work and him and the Violetta are the stars of the show. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh,